your Tiger Vision news for Friday, September 16th. I'm Presley, and this is my co-host, Riley. Thanks for joining us today. We're starting off today's show by turning on our teacher spotlight. Today, the spotlight falls on Ms. Pitcock. Ms. Pitcock teaches science, and uh, her students really enjoy being part of her class. Here's more. Hi, I'm Addie here with... Mrs. Pitcock. Where did you go to college? I went to Texas Tech. Get your guns up. Mm -mm. Okay. Um, what's your favorite thing about teaching? Oh, I love to see when the kids new le uh, learn new things, and I can actually see their light bulbs go on. How long have you been teaching? I've been teaching 18 years. I'm old. What is the most interesting thing about you? Well, I don't eat bananas or pudding or jello because they're slimy. I won't touch slimy foods. Thank you. Hi, I'm Clara here with Kevin, Deja, and Ethan. What is your favorite thing about Miss Pickup? She's nice. She's cool. She's nice. Thank you. Hi, I'm here with Eve and Gabby. What's your favorite thing about Miss Pickup? She always finds a way to make me laugh. She's really funny. Thank you. Thanks, Ms. Pitcock. And now let's take a trip to the other side of the building where Corbin is standing by with Mr. Mack. I'm Corbin here with... Mr. Mack. Do you have any students new to Texas? I know I have one, Kyler Gilchrist. I think he's from, moved here from Virginia. Uh, that's the only one I know of that's moved in from out of state. Why is Texas history so important? Well, any history is important because if we don't know our history, we're doomed to repeat our mistakes. But it also tells us who we are, where we come from, why we act the way we do, why we have the culture the, that we have. But Texas history is unique, and it's different from any other state. We were a nation uh, and before we became a state. And so it just has a lot of history. It's a very unique history, and it's fun to study. Thanks for that report, Corbin. Hey, we have something fun next week. What is it? It's recess. Oh yeah, cool. It's scheduled for Wednesday. Get all of your work turned in before then. I will. If any of you don't have your work turned in, you'll have to make up your work at the Blitz. That's no fun. Get your work turned in. Members of the FMS Women's Choir will attend a special event next week. They'll travel to Texas Tech University where they will be a part of a women's clinic to help them polish up their singing skills. It should be a fun trip. We know they're looking forward to it. Members of the FMS Band's percussion section and the Twirlers will compete at the West Texas Auxiliary Championships. That contest is a week from tomorrow. They always do a great job. We'll have more on the story next week. Now let's check in with Luke and see what's going on in weather. I'm Luke here with you. Our current conditions are partly cloudy with 73 degrees, winds southwest 10 miles per hour, and precipitation is 40%. We have a little bit of rain in our area and some up in Little Rock. Here's a look at our five-day forecast. Nice temperatures expected this weekend with a pretty good chance of rain. I'm Luke with your other back to you. Thanks, Luke. Now let's find out what's going on in sports. Hello, FMS sports fans. I'm Addie, and this is Carl's. Here's a look at today's sports. It's Friday, and it's time for the Athlete of the Week. Let's find out which athletes are in the honor this week. Hi, I'm Carson here with William, and congratulations on being Athlete of the Week. What sport are you in? I'm in football. What do you like most about your sport? Running the ball. Thank you. Hi, I'm Carson here with Connor. Congratulations on being Athlete of the Week. What sport do you play? Uh, football. Uh, what's your favorite thing about your sport? Uh, getting to run the ball and getting to hit people. Thank you. Hi, I'm Carson here with Kayton. Congratulations on being Athlete of the Week. What sport do you play? Volleyball. What's your favorite thing about, about volleyball? Um, just being with a great team and getting to play. Hi, I'm Carly here with Addison. Congratulations on being Athlete of the Week. What sport are you in? Volleyball. What do you like most about your sport? Hitting. Thank you. Congratulations to our Athletes of the Week. There's a big football game tonight. Yes, there is. The Varsity Tiger team will play Abilene Cooper in what would be one of the best games of the year. Kickoff is set for seven tonight at People's Bank Stadium. Try to get there early so you'll get a good seat. Our football teams play Heritage Monday and Tuesday. Seventh grade plays Monday, eighth grade plays Tuesday. Those games will be at People's Bank Stadium. Make plans to show up and support our teams. 
The next tennis matches are on October 3rd. The, the A team plays Heritage at Heritage at 410. The B team will play them on the 5th, and the C team will play them on the 6th. Getting some good practice before then, Tigers. Well, that's a look at today's sports. Back to you. Dab, Dab and conceal. conceal. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you next time. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye. Dab, Dab and conceal. conceal.